Sorry about that, you guys. Welcome back to the Wise Lemon Way. We're making some seafood pella pella um, rice with eggs today. And we're about to put our egg in to our pan. And you can see, see it while we do it. Okay? Just want to mix it in there. Get that little eggy taste. And remember, we were saving our onions here. We can go ahead, put a little more onions in there. So we have, if you notice, we have our, our stove up pretty high because this is a wok. And you, if you can go ahead. We don't want to mix too much of the egg in to the rice until it's almost fully done. Like that, it tastes better. Like that, you guys. Okay. So you guys, we're gonna go ahead, let that cook for a while. Okay. Gonna bring that down just a little because I have to go over here and find some shrimp. Oh, here we go. Yep, going for something. Okay, you guys, the egg is almost cooked to the point where we can go ahead and mix it in now. Okay, we want to show you how we're going to do this. See, we can take and flip it over. Bring it down. Definitely bring the heat down now. Okay, so now that the rice is a little harder, we can go ahead mix these things in okay so we'll set that to the side we're going to put a little boiler here because what we want to do now and you guys this sesame oil isn't as bad as you think as one may think it is so we're going to go ahead once we make sure our pan is bone dry, you know, because we wash things by hands here. So, you guys, while we're waiting for, mm, while we're waiting for that pan to become bone dry, okay, we want to show you here, okay, there's the board, you guys, see the board? Let's turn it a little so you see just the kitchen. Okay, so we have these little seafood cake mix that we also wanna go ahead. We need to get some water. We can pour some water into our pot. Okay. Here we go. Just a little water needs to go into the pot. So we can help throw out the little fish cake mix. And this is delicious with this dish. That's why we turn um, the rice, the fried rice, we went on, okay, so we're pouring some water. Turn the heat up on high. Because, you guys, we want that water to boil. And so we're going to take and break these apart, as you can see. And we're going to put them right here. Drop them, every last one of them, right into our pan. And you guys, this is the fish cake mix right here. It's delicious. You can pick it up at um, Walmart. Okay. So, you learn to do new things when you're trying to stay on a healthy lifestyle. And I don't like to use the word diet too much as me and my cousin Devon was talking about because it... It, 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 it has like a connotation to it that I don't like. Anyhow, we're going to move along. 
I'm sorry, I'm talking and our fire is not on. So this won't take long at all. And especially when you have a top on your pots and stuff, of course things cook much faster. Okay, almost left those out. Don't wanna do that because we need that. Okay, so we'll just put our tools, our cooking tools all up here along with the rice we're going to use later we don't need these dishes here okay so we're going to let that go ahead and cook and here is our rice you guys it's looking good huh fried rice pella pella fried pella pella rice seafood Make sure. So we got that to the side. It's starting to boil right now, you guys. And so I'm going to go ahead and take some of the onion here that's still up here and put it in our little bowl. We're going to need this because I tell you that onion flavor. I wish we had green onions here, but we don't. If it was the summertime where, you know, we were constantly growing our food it would have been super simple for us to bring our green onion from the garden right into the kitchen and cut it fresh and eat it. So anyway, life goes on. Or as my cousin Kieran say, such as life. Okay, so we thank you guys for tuning in. Um, I hope you guys can pull something from this. Let's check and see how tender they're becoming. We just want our seafood mix to be tender enough um, to be able to, um, you know, cut, cut it down some, dice it or whatever, to incorporate it into our um, fried um, pella pella with the egg and everything and onion, okay? So this is really working out nice, you guys. I'm glad you guys are here with us today i hope you're having a lovely day uh we hope you guys um saw our um last video tea time with tree and we were showing you more tips on the um the, the organic banana tea and um we're we're now just totally getting organic bananas because if you eat enough bananas it's a good thing to go organic so i think our seafood little mixtures are really coming out nice far as throwing out and soon we can go ahead and cut those so while we're waiting i'll go ahead and take the knife that we use you guys we're going to wipe that off we have a sink right here very close to the stove, which is a good thing. It cuts down a lot of moving around. We get plenty of exercise, that's not the problem. So anyway, let's turn up our music a little. We don't own the rights to the music you hear. Okay, you guys, so now that that's ready, we're gonna take this pot and we're gonna bring this back over here. And remember I talk about making sure that your handles is turned in such a way that no one will get hurt. Okay, so all we have to do with this, you guys, we're just going to grab them and we're going to put them right here on our board and you're not going to miss a thing. Okay, so here we go. They're nice and soft now and <laughs> don't want them to roll off <laughs> okay here we go and we're going to put all of these in with the rice i want to shake off some of that excess water because you don't want too much water mixing with your um fried pella pella or rice whatever you want to call it Okay, you guys, so here we go. Yes, indeed, this is how we're gonna do it. Okay, beautiful. Okay, we'll put that right up top like this here.
this is going to be delicious because we're just going to dice them in four so you'll be able to taste the, um, be able to taste. Put it right in the pan and once we get them cut up the way we want them to, you know, or diced up, whichever way you want to say. If I sound a little ebonic, oh, it is what it is, okay? Um, we're just throwing them in. We may not need all these, but we will determine this at the end, okay? Because we get in quite a bit of the fish cake, which has a really nice seafood taste. It's Asian, it's an Asian made fish cake and it's delicious, I love it. Okay, so here we go again. And what it tastes like lobster and it tastes like shrimp. So maybe I'll just take these pieces like this and put them in. And I think actually we have enough in our dish. We don't want to, one more won't hurt you guys, right? Okay, here we go. Let's do one more. You know what I think I want to do with all of them though? Okay, so that should be good. I don't want no big pieces in there, but this is good. So you guys, like I said, we shall turn the oven back up on high. And let us get our spatula, you guys. This is what it's looking like. You know I'm going to show you the product. Okay, so now what we're going to do, let me keep my hand down here. I don't want to cut the camera off again. Okay, so here we go, you guys. I really don't have to go in and stir this up like this here. This is what we're going to do. Once it gets hot enough, let's put that water over here. So once it get hot enough, all we really have to do, you see, we have to make sure we get a good fry. Okay. So you what you know, you guys. I really don't want to use a lot. So far, we use about. I say a half a tablespoon of oil. So this here will probably bring us to a tablespoon of oil. There's a very tiny hole in our sesame um, container or bottle. And so it doesn't really pour out a lot. So don't think I just used a lot. Anyway, let's get this turned over the way we want it. Okay. Oh, you guys, don't that look good? My, my, my. This can be breakfast, lunch, dinner, whatever you choose. But we definitely want to get it much higher. Okay, so let's sit this thing up here like this. Let's see how it's going to flow. Yeah, there we go, you guys. Okay. And in the meanwhile, we can definitely... Get our, get a little baggie to put the rest of these little fish cake balls in. And we're just going to probably, you know, eat it as a snack or something whenever the time comes. Okay, so here we go. It's up really high. So let's go ahead and give it a nice turn, you guys. Look at that. Woo! You see that, you guys? This is what it's looking like. Okay, and we have to, and we must use our spatula to soften it up. I say let's use the opposite side where it's more rounder. That is really looking delicious, you guys. Okay. You guys, here we go with the last of our onions. We're gonna go ahead and put our onions in. 
And now we're going to turn off the power. Yeah, you guys, looking good, huh? So, let's get us a nice bowl, you guys, to show you what it's looking like. Um, you don't need that. Here we go. Perfect bowl, you guys. I want to show you. Here we go. One. nice bowls. Well, she can use this one. Okay, here we go. Yes, indeed. Here we go, you guys. So, really what we have to do is kind of organize some things here. Everything is a little bit out of whack. <laughs> okay, here we go. We know what we need, know what we use. So we're gonna simply push our camera back just a little. And we wanna show you our finished dish. Good, look at that, y'all. Looks good. Look, you guys. I might be able to see a whole dish. Let's put it right there. That's a perfect spot. We'll bring this over here. Okay, here we go. You're going to get to see everything. So here go our rice and the seafood mix with the Pella Pella. Oh my goodness. Sesame oil, onions, fried onions, you guys, and cooked onions. So let me show you how we're going to give this dish to the folks who's going to be eating it. This is how we do our dishes, you guys, okay? Is that not beautiful or what? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So, I'm just showing you a technique. Look at this. Okay? This is how we do it. We keep all the food in. This is nice, you guys. Let it sit for a minute. Okay. Grab another plate. Before we do that, you guys, we want a nice, fresh, clean counter, right? Okay. Here we go. All right. Yes, indeed. Thank you guys for tuning in. It's an awesome day. Now look at this, you guys. I always tell you this is how we do it. We take our bowl or plate, we put it right over. Well, if it's a plate, it'll work better. So how about we just take this and let's make sure you can see the whole plate now because this is a show right here. Look, there you go. Uh-oh, perfect. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. My, my, my. What do you say about that? Sheesh. And you know, we're going to fill the other bowl up so we can do the other plate as well. Okay? This is a delicious meal, you guys. If you haven't tried it, ooh. To try it, you guys. It's more than good. So I have school tonight. I have some work I need to get done with Golden Rule Wellness Mission, you guys. I'm just emptying the rest of the content into the bowl here. Okay. If you like this video, you guys go ahead and press share. So other people can get to see our content of this video. And this is how we do it, okay? Now, if you're using a, um, a, a um, spatula or whatever you're using to um, mold 
your um, food into a bowl, I always say that the spoon works wonders. The spoon works wonders. Look at that, you guys. Okay? It leaves no space open. So, you guys, we the longer you let it sit, the better the mold comes out, in case you don't know. But this is what we're going to do on another plate. Same style of plate. So, we'll put this plate right there. We'll put another plate here. And you guys, are you ready for it? Okay, here we go. We don't want it to fall. See, we have the plate here. Now we can turn it over, you know, just the way we do um, cakes, you know? Look at that, you guys. Is that not an art a food? Well, you guys, there it is. Just hold on one minute. We can't do without our dressing up our plate. And maybe today, this is what we're going to use. Okay, we have this. You guys hang in there. Appreciate you hanging around, watching us on this video. We're about to show you the um, end results of this dish. We're just going to get our avocado to make everything right. Hold on, you guys. Here we go. Slide that right through there. We're just going to do one avocado. My daughter loves avocado. She's spending some time with me right now. Um, uh, a few days and that's it. But here we go, you guys. You want to take your spoon with your avocado. Let's get this baby out. See, when you go along the edges, it comes out beautiful. Uh-oh, I really didn't want it to really get loose like that. But anyway, you guys, this is what we're doing here. We're going to take our avocado. Okay? Just going to do couple of little small slices to go along with this meal. Okay? Yep. Just to go along with our meal. Look at that, you guys. Hmm. Don't that look nice? Yep. This is how we do it, you guys. This is a healthy meal. We like seafood get that little meat in and now we're about to dress it up a little with a special seasoning we have if you guys want to know what we use look at that you got to put some greens up there some kind of way if you guys want to know what we use just go ahead and shoot us a comment we'll be happy to let you know what we use we have one more thing that's going to bring this home. Uh-oh, that fell down. Okay. So, you guys, I've been doing a makeover here. And this one don't want to stay up because I moved something, trying to organize, fix up, and beautify things. So, we'll leave it here, but we'll leave it right there for now. Anyway, it is what it is. Okay. Lastly, here we have our baby romaine, or shall I say crispy romaine lettuce here where we're going to drizzle. Look at that, you guys. Now, see, this is how you eat good. You know, what you eat has everything to do with how long you're going to be around, you know? That's very important to talk about. Okay, so let's put this so it'll beautify the plate. Um, validate <laughs> this meal. So I tell you, when you make and prepare your meals, you always want to prepare your meals to make it look delicious in your home restaurant. Look at that, you guys. Is that not a beauty? You see that? Beautiful. Okay. 
So once again, you guys, look at this. We have Pella Pella seafood, fried rice with fried onions, lightly fried in sesame oil and fresh onions diced. And we have some um, fish um, cake mix with crispy multicolor baby romaine lettuce, you guys. So, here's a meal served for wellness. Okay, you guys. Now, we thank you for tuning in. We hope you guys have an awesome rest of the day. Be wise, be well, and always think higher for you and your family. Then, you will be helping everyone and you will be in the will of our Heavenly Father, Creator, God, Allah, Jehovah, whatever you choose to call him. He is what he is. He says, I am that I am. And we are all children of the kingdom and companions in life such as this time. Ashe.